Well, hello, welcome back. Toss today here talking technology for beginners and beyond. Well, speaking of Linux beginners, I think I may have another winner for you guys. And by the way, I've come to the conclusion that Linux Mint's Mate or Mate desktop stands for Magnificent, Amazing, Terrific, Exceptional. And why do I say that? Well, number one, because I use it, but really number two, because it seems like every month there is a new Linux-based operating system with the Mate desktop, and that's a good thing because I think it's very easy to use for everybody. Something new, Black Lab Linux. Uh, I'll have links for all this below in the show notes, by the way. Black Lab Linux has the new Mate version, Mate desktop. So let's take a quick look at this and see what we have. Now I am quite familiar with this, so I will not be installing this. I am running this inside a virtual box and it seems to run pretty good. This is basically a lightweight desktop. Right click and you have the usual shortcuts here. I won't go into all of this because I have a funny feeling that many of you or at least some of you have seen this before or may even have this uh, especially if you are running Linux Mint. Alright a panel here at the bottom looks like four workspaces of course sound menu shortcut there we go my microphone is right there one of my favorite things about uh, the Mate desktop is the ability to right click and add uh, applications or applets uh, to your panel. For example, let's type in weather. Alright, I'll put that there. It's showing zero. But let's go ahead and type in a place where I wish I was again in Orlando, Florida. If I can spell. We'll go with Orlando International Airport and it is a very nice 61 degrees because here I live in Ohio it's like zero with a wind chill of negative like WTF. Anyway, moving along, it looks like Firefox is installed by default including Thunderbird, Mail Client. Let's see, click here to sh hide all windows. Okay, let's uh, see what we have here. All right, very good. I like the use of the colors and the white space and the icons. This is Kajah File Manager. Again, very easy to use, of course, computer. All right, network and installing Black Lab Linux. I'm ins I'm, I will assume this has an automatic installer for you beginners. Let's take a look at the menu. Uh, oh, very good. This has the Linux Mint uh, Mint menu. Cool. It's one of my favorites. You can choose between all applications, favorites. Let's take a quick look uh, here. Accessories. See if anything catches my eye. Let's go back. Uh, Spring Seed. Simply awesome note taking. Well, I didn't know that. Education. Okay. Math. Games. Steam. Okay. Graphics. The GIMP. Very good. Internet. Uh, the usual. Firefox Office, LibreOffice by default. Let's see, we VLC installed by default, very good. System Tools, uh, the Mate Terminal, the Package Installer GW, very good. Let's take a look at the System Monitor. This is probably, yep, I would have said between three and 400 megabytes. Okay, very good. You notice this is running pretty smooth, huh? Universal Access, Administration, uh, what did I see here, App Grid, oh yeah, I think I took a look at this last year, this is another way to install or uninstall your pieces of software on your computer, this actually looks pretty good, I kind of like this, you may like this better than the uh, Ubuntu Software Center or the Software Center or you might like this. Actually this might be easier to use than the uh, Synaptic Package Manager. Alright so that's cool. Let's move along real quick here. Preferences, Disks, Backup, Appearance. Okay. Let's take a look. Uh, maybe one more thing. What caught my eye here? Yeah, control center. Let's 
let's see anything special here let's go to mate mate tweak what is that I don't think I've seen that before desktop or I guess it's a way to customize your computer desktop Bluetooth mate the new panel will lay out activation activated Open indicators mate desktop Ubuntu mate all right nice customizations here let's see real quick if this does anything the mate desktop icons large sure why not leave it the way it is now this is not installed so I don't know if this will work it's still processing maybe I broke it hmm okay well it's missing the menu here again this is not has not been fully installed but it doesn't matter because I have to tell you uh, so far I like what I see so why don't you guys take a look at this yes I know it's another respin of Linux Mint or Mate I know what you guys are gonna say but that's not always bad especially for something lightweight and fast and simple to use and I bet you dollars to donuts Caden Live will work perfectly on this version of Mate alright before I begin or before I begin yeah before I end don't forget to vote would you buy the new Ubuntu phone? The poll ends in about three days, uh, February 20th. As of this recording, it is the 17th here in the States. Over 51% of you say yes. Very good news for the fine folks at Ubuntu. The phone did sell out. I'm assuming they will probably have another sale and there is another company. Um, I think the company Misu, Misu coming out with their version of the Ubuntu phone next month in March. I'll have links for all this below in the show notes. Uh, one last last thing I'm thinking about the next live toss today live event for some time in March. Let me know, let me know if you guys have any suggestions comments or topics. Um, I've been doing these trying to do these about once a month. I know the last one was right before Christmas. If this is something you would like to see on a regular basis or simply would like to support the channel, please consider uh, supporting this and being a sponsor through the Patreon page or a simple donation with PayPal so I can upgrade the equipment that I have here. As always, thank you so much for your support in the past. Uh, this is almost five years of this channel. I could not have done it without you guys. Thank you very much for permitting me, for allowing me to come into your wonderful homes. That's it for this one. And as always, I will catch all of you sometime in the future.